Hey everybody, we are featuring something new today. A place where chocolate, old fashioned maple, and cream filled comes into play. Oh, for sure. And what's impressive about these ladies is at midnight, these boss babes turn into baking maniacs where they're literally just creating all these handcrafted baked goods for the community. And this is literally the rage right now in this town. Yeah, so let's go meet them. All right, let's do it. So my town is your town. And, and let's, let's explore, explore it together. together. hot spot we see some familiar faces here hey hi guys how you doing awesome hi everyone hi oh who is this cutie pie um tessie so this is tessie oh, beautiful name and what do you have there tessie i have a donut really sprinkles on it oh that looks like fun doesn't it is it really yummy did you try a big bite of it take a big bite for us do you want me to take a bite? If I take a bite, will you take a bite? Mmm. Here, you take a bite. Mmm. <gasps> yummy. Welcome. We're here with the owners of Mystic Donuts. I'm here with Natalie. I'm here with Katie and Michelle and their baby. Okay. And so we're here located at 29971 Harbor Way in Gold Beach, Oregon. And so we're just going to just get to know you guys a little bit. Okay. And want to ask you guys what drove you guys to come together and just open this amazing hot spot here. Well, um, Katie and I met um, working at a job managing a restaurant together. And we quickly became close friends because it was a pretty intense job. <laughs> and uh, everything shut down because of COVID. And, and we thought... Wouldn't it be great if we could just work for ourselves? And because um, there's not, you know, the jobs are limited in this area. So we kind of threw out some ideas, didn't know what to do. One day Katie said, what if we did a donut shop? <laughs> but my grandma, um, she opened a bakery and coffee shop when she was younger with her best friend. And my mom grew up in the bakery and always loved coffee. And Katie's, <laughs> and Katie's background is all in coffee. So we thought, you know what, it would be really fun to do a bakery coffee shop. And everybody here wants donuts so bad. It would be so much fun to do that. And so it just kind of started developing into this idea that came to life. <laughs> it is pretty fabulous. I was really impressed. We came here one morning, and before they even opened up the doors, there is a line of people outside the doors, which was really impressive. Yeah. So, yeah. It's been a line almost every morning. I think today was our first day, it kind of mellowed out. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. It's exciting. So, what are your specials? What are your specialty donuts or anything specialty that you guys offer? Uh, so one of our specialties is our kolache. Um, it's mint, a Texas kolache is what it is. Um, and it's a breakfast sausage with either bacon or jalapeno and cheddar cheese. And then it's wrapped in our donut dough. And it's really good. Everybody is a little like Everybody it. loves it yeah. so far. <laughs> but like, don't try it. It's, it's like the rumor around town. Everyone comes in like, I heard about this sausage thing we gotta get. Yeah, I just I just really had a pre-order and they're like, I'll take six bacon, kolaches, and six jalapeno. I'm like, oh, oh have you had it? And they're like, no, we just heard it was good. I'm like, oh, right. It sounds so unique. Yeah, really good. So yeah. it's something that was your original recipe? No, so, well, it is our, it's our recipe, but when I lived in Texas, I would get it all the time. And it was such a popular thing there. And, yeah, there's nothing like that here, so there is. Why, not, why not just try it? And we made it one day and we're like, we really like it. <laughs> I really, really like it. Yeah. Yeah, we took one home okay. and we tried it and it was delicious. Yeah. 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 My husband says, go get some more. Go <laughs> get some more. Because you can't find anything like that here. No, no. Yeah. Yeah. So if you were to talk to someone, what would you tell them how they would go about pursuing their passion? Like you have um, well, it definitely takes having the vision of what you want to do, and um, what we've really found is the the determination to start, but it's the, the keep going part because there's a, you always hit that wall where you're like, okay, this is really really hard, and we don't know what we're doing, and it's so unknown. But to the, like, I guess surrender to the fear of the unknown and say, let's just see what happens when we keep going into the that 
Absolutely. Absolutely. <laughs> I think your drive and your motivation has a lot to do with it. Yeah. You know, you've got a lot of energy. I see a lot of good things happening for you ladies already has. Mm -hmm. um, we're just excited that you came to, well, you've been here in Goldie, yeah. but you've been here and just opened something up like this. And yeah, I think a lot you. of the community is actually embracing their, their business, and it shows. It definitely does. Thank you. Thank you. So, thank you. you guys, thank you for joining us. Please remember to like, comment, and share the videos. Get on their Facebook page. Just keep track of some of the new things that they'll be doing. But definitely, let's support local. Thank you, guys. See you Bye. next time. Bye-bye.